one week from tomorrow is Thanksgiving. Wow. If you are hosting this year, we want to remind you what can happen if you're not careful with what you put down the sink drain. This is the part where we told you bring everyone to the television, <laughs> especially the people you know have been wrong for a long time. The yeah. city of Kansas City takes this very seriously because of all that fat and oil and grease from your food does not just impact your drain at right. your house. 41 Action News reporter Ray Daniel live this morning to show us how it can lead to headaches and backups down the road and talk about the right way Look. to handle that, Ray. Oh, she's been walking around the newsroom with this. Look at that thing. Okay, so it's so easy to do, right, Taylor and Lindsay? You have just a little bit of grease. You just want to pour it down the drain. Like, it's only a little bit, but that can have some serious damage to your drain. So, to your pipes. So, what you can do, you can get a can like this. This is actually filled with grease, as you can see. But you can get a can like this, and every time you have the, that grease or those oil, just pour it into the can, put it in the freezer, and then once it's filled, go ahead and pour it out. If you don't, this is what will happen. Go ahead and take a look at this video. I hung out with Casey Water a couple of days ago and they were just kind of showing me with the video. Um, they got into one of the manholes and all that white stuff you see um, is grease, grease from restaurants, grease, grease from apartment buildings. So they had to get what's called a grease nozzle just to go ahead and wash that all out from the sides as well as the top and the bottom just to make sure that water can be running float through through that area um, just nice and smoothly because if not it can cause backups not only to your neighborhood but it can cause you know a stressful situation to the city as well it, it can uh, adhere to the walls collect against the walls and then cause a restriction of flow which minimizes the diameter in the pipe and then you have solids and other materials that collect against it which causes a backup So we will get more into this around 650, but as you can see, I mean, it's not going anywhere, this grease. Now, if you want to pitch it somewhere, there is a place you can pitch it at the hazardous uh, waste materials facility. It's right behind me near 4707 Doramus, and they're open Thursdays, Fridays, and Saturdays. Reporting live in Kansas City, Ray Daniel, 41 Action News Today.